Hello and welcome to my channel Solvector. Today I am adding domain controller on Windows Server 2008. So just I am putting on my password. Okay. Okay. First we make as a domain controller on this PC. So make sure everything is perfect. So is it has a network time zone set and i just check one more time before i start as a domain controller this pc so just click here and go to network properties and it's say 192.168.100 so this is the main pc so click okay and go back to this here close okay close this one and then do not show this one close and after we have go to start button we are can make DC DC promo and a start yes come on DC and it, this is stored Active Directory and DNS server to the this Windows Server 2008 and after this install we can check uh, Active Directory and where we can make the users and computer add to this network and a part of this domain so just wait few seconds when it's done so we can add the users to the computer Click next and so create a new domain in the new forest. Click next and so I just put like A G T N for my domain name dot com. checking the name so it's not match with anything and here we can use the forest level like you can use 2008 server r2 anyone you can use click on that r2 clicks this and this is called the dns server 2 so a dedication okay so just click yes net bios and everything save on to this computer and password so for is a domain password so it should be separate from the administrator password so yeah. one two three four so go this way next and click on here so after when this done it's complete and it's re restart the PC so wait for a few seconds so when it's done so we can So Active Directory install, DNS server install and it's restart and then we have to log into the domain. So so 
So it's almost done this part. And it's applying computer settings for the server. And if you can see, I just put cursor here, it's a Windows Server 2008 R2. So I just make a domain controller in R2. You can make any domain controller if you like to. But I choose like the same year, 2008. And this is installed, so just click on the input. So it's right here. And this time is a part of domain. So put the password in. Password one. And it's log into the and it's apply the setting and all desktop for the server. So all right so here we can go here and active directory domain services is shows here dns server is here so we can go back here start and first time click here so we can see here active directory administrative center domain trust and active directory module and this is the Active Directory user and computers where we can add user and computer to this network. So this time this is a domain acton.com and here is you can see the users and here you can add user like if you want to use as a new user click as a computer or you can use as a user so you can put like I can put like Sam uh, Ram and login user login name is Sam Sam and at acten.com so just click next and as the password so you can put P A S S W O R D password two so. password too so say user must change password or user can user can change cannot change the password or password never expires so I just click this one and move the first one so click password not match so maybe oh I forgot to put here so P A S S W O R D password too and I have to change this one here, PSS password 2 and just click next. So new user should be added and after you can see you have a new user and here you can use like user computer you can use like a new computer if you connect to the in future the computer we connect through the network so I will add the computer but so you can add the computer and it shows on the network so this is all for the this one and everything here you can see server manager role dns server is installed so everything is working you have a look forward lookup zone and reverse lookup where you can add the like if you don't find the server new zone you can create the new zone here click next and you can do the say primary zone creates a copy of the zone that cannot update directly on the server or you can click here and I look up zone so I can put my network ID here so it goes backward to 192.168.1.1.168.1 so just save it 
and is is can go the reverse and to find the computer so how you add the things here and same this adversary tool active directory computer and user where we can add any user to this computer so double click here and here are the users and computer so you can add any computer this time is no computer here but same thing if I click here new computer I can put name R U D Y Rory U D Y Rory and it's a default domain admin change and it's say okay so it shows this computer right here but I have to do add a new computer to this I have to go another setting and add the computer to this network so this is how you install the Active Directory and DNS Server to Windows Server 2000 and uh, if you like my channel please like and subscribe subscribe thank you